Welcome to Door of Mercy. I'm Gabriel Chow. In the Jubilee of Mercy, the Pope encourages us to practice works of mercy. The spiritual works of mercy include instructing the ignorant, forgiving offenses, bearing persecution. In the history of the Church, the martyrs practice these works to the end. In this episode, I will bring you to a country of martyrs. Let's go to Seoul, the capital of Korea. Korea is a unique country, where the Catholic faith started with lay persons, not through missionaries. Although the church has only slightly more than 200 years of history, it has undergone much persecution, having 10,000 martyrs. Now, the church in Korea is flourishing because of the blood of the martyrs. The Jubilee shrines of Seoul that we are visiting are all related to the Korean martyrs. It's good to be here Good to be with you, my Chinggu Let's first go to downtown Myeongdong, where the Cathedral of the Archdiocese of Seoul is located. It is the symbol of Catholicism in Korea. In 1784, the first Catholic community in the country was established here. It was not until 1898 that this church was built the second one ever in Korea, and was placed under the patronage of the Immaculate Conception. The cathedral was built in the Gothic Revival style, with the color of its bricks blending into nature. In the 1970s and 80s, the cathedral became the place for democratic movement, and played an important role for human rights in Korea. The crypt contains bodies of many martyrs, including the saint who was the second vicar apostolic of Korea. Constructed six years earlier than the cathedral, the Yakyan Church holds the honor of being the first church and the first Western building in the country, dating back to 1892. Many Catholics were martyred in this area. 44 of them have been canonized. The third Jubilee Church is San Amtao Shrine along the Han River. This Korean-style structure was built in 1987 at the place where felons were executed in the past. Many Catholics were martyred here in the 19th century, including the first missionary to come to Korea, Father James Jo, and the first Korean priest, St. Andrew Kim Tae-gon. The last Jubilee Church of the Archdiocese, also located on the hill along Han River, is Chua Du San Martyr's Shrine. It is the most important shrine in Korea commemorating the cruelest persecution around 1870. Countless Catholics were beheaded here. The bell tower is modeled on the shape of the beheading instruments placed on each martyr. The shrine contains a martyr's memorial museum with thousands of precious exhibits about the martyrs. There is another Jubilee church in Seoul, the Armed Forces Central Church. It is the Cathedral of the Military Ordinariate, which served the army in the whole country. Several martyrs are buried here. In the Jubilee of Mercy, let's learn from the examples of the martyrs, witnessing mercy till we return to our Heavenly Father's embrace. See you next time. <laughs> 